Well, so this is Whiterun, huh? Looks humongous compared to Riverwood. Very impressive indeed. Oh, wow. The moon looks incredible. So beautiful. <coughs> Evening, good sir. I'm new to the city and would appreciate your help. Whoa! What the fuck? Wanna hear a little Nord wisdom? I guess. You don't really know a woman till you've had a strong drink and a fist fight with her. Oi, dirty git. Need what are you something. doing brushing up against me like that? What the fuck is going on? Nobody heard of personal space? Ah, Baldy! Just seeing things again. Evening again, good sir. Sorry for the rude interruption. Anywhere you recommend to stay, my good man. Do I look like a fucking tourist guide to you? Whoa! Jeez, dude. What the hell is up with you? I'd hold my tongue if I were you. I'll find we'll it myself then. It takes, <laughs> but we must have more swords oh no, my shoelaces. I just can't fill an order what that they size arguing on about? my own. Why don't you swallow that stubborn pride of yours and ask Yorland Greymane for help? <laughs> I'd sooner bend my knee to Ulfric's Stormcloak. Besides, Greymane would never make steel for the Legion. Have it your way. I'll take the job, but don't expect a miracle. Hmm. Not an argument, I guess. Just an order or something. Not very interesting. Wonder who this Ulfric Stormcloak character is. Heard his name mentioned a couple of times now. <coughs> so, this must be the blacksmith. Ugh, flashbacks to Alvor's. Can't even sharpen a dagger. I'm pathetic. The drunken huntsman. Sounds like some sort of gentleman's club. Don't feel like getting my ass pinched all night. No thanks. Still too tender after the last wolf attack. Think I'll keep looking. Oh, my God. I fucking love cheese. Wow, just look at them all. You delicious little bastards. Um, well, maybe not the ones at the end. That one looks a billion years old. Gross. These beautiful yellow bastards, though. Hell yeah. Ugh, making me so hungry. Hopefully I can find some work, earn some coin to buy some of that cheese. I'll be back for you, cheese. Oh my fucking god. Is that what I think it is? It is. Oh, a goat. So frigging cute. Oh, what's this? Some kind of notice board or something. Oh, sweet. A notice board for jobs. Wow. Crazy to see how far I've travelled from home. You're doing all right, Willow. Looks like there's plenty of work around here. That's a relief too tired to think about jobs right now. Get some rest, then check in the morning. Eee! Oh, look at him. Little fluffy bundle of cuteness. Hey there, little fella. What you up to? Oh, such a little cutie. Where you going, little fella? Huh? Oh, look at that little face. Gorgeous. Ooh, what's this then? A bloody axe! Thanks, Mr. Goat, you are indeed the goat. An axe just lying there would be rude not to, right? Just make sure nobody's looking. Oh no, my shoelaces. Yoink! Don't think anyone saw that. Well, let's hope not anyway. Ugh, what's this? You're exhausted. Blah, blah, blah. Get to bed and get some rest, remove the debuffs. <sighs> Oh, wow, hungry too. Double whammy. I don't think I have anything I can eat. Nothing that's cooked anyway. Crap, everything is raw. I'll just need to buy a meal or something when I find somewhere to stay. Wonder if the axe is any better than the dagger. Definitely a slight upgrade. Should switch over to using the axe instead. Thanks again, Mr. Goat, for showing me where that axe was. You're a gentleman. Bloody love goats. Where is everyone? It's like a ghost town here. 
Oi, Mr Goat, where is everyone? Did all the townsfolk get turned into goats or something? Here, little chick, chick, chick. Oh, a guard! Phew! Come on over here. Hmm, just a leg, maybe? What the fuck? Here, chicky, chicky. Should I? I could eat you whole, little chicken. What the fuck is wrong with this guard? Eating a live chicken, really? Better hide all the raw meat I have. You okay, good sir? Fucking starving. That chicken looks fucking tasty. Yeah, you might want to cook it first, mate. Don't want the shits now, do you? At this point, I don't care. Gross. Haven't eaten all day. So hungry. Free ingredients. Don't mind if I do. I'd probably run if I were you, Mrs Chicken. Here, chick chick. Fuck me. Come on now, dude. Arcadia's cauldron. Must be some sort of alchemists. We'll have to check it out in the morning. Oh, wow. So that's where everyone has been. Getting pissed up at the inn. Fair enough, I guess. Hi there, kind sir. Is this the local inn? Huh? Do they have rooms for the night? I'm new in town and need somewhere to crash for the night. We'll have to have a pint together sometime, you and me. Huh? Are you asking me out on a date? Hey, where you going? You can take me out for a drink tonight. I'm not desperate, I promise. Buy me a meal? Fucking tease. The bannered mayor. Let's hope they have a room for the night. Imperial mail? What's all that about? That guard is so fucked up. Glad I'm heading inside. I mean, wouldn't you just get a mouthful of feathers? Strange man. Thank you, thank you. No, please. Ooh, very Hold fancy. Looks stop. nice One in second. here. Yeah? Bit busier All than I thought right it would be. Now. You have to be oh, fucking kidding me, right? I really have Welcome. to get something else to more comfortable to wear. I got a clean mug around Easier to put on. Do they just have these barred assholes in every inn around Skyrim or something? Can't stand them. Should get myself something to eat. I'm grouchy. Oh, over here, ma'am! Wake up to you. have to talk with Bulger. No, yes, ma'am. Cool. Yes, over here, here please. And so then came clashing and slashing you want a drink? Oh, hi there, fair lady. I'm bloody starving. Can you sort me out with a proper meal, please? Of course. All the golden hammer Thanking you, ma'am. That was delicious. What else you got on the menu? Depends. Are you thirsty? Hungry? Both. Should get something for tomorrow. Let's see. More expensive than I was expecting. Fuck me, 500 for a bottle of wine? Oh, how the other half live, hey? These aren't going to fill a hole. Huh. I can probably afford this cooked potato, ugh. So damn poor. Thanks again, kind ma'am. I appreciate the food. Now please, no more questions. Huh, didn't think I asked many questions. Apologies, ma'am. Jeez. Evening, sir. Yes? There's a guard outside about to eat a live chicken. All right, then. Okay. Expected a bit more of a reaction, if I'm honest. <clears throat> Should inquire about a room for the night. Forgot to plug his drum in. <clears throat> Fucking bards. Okay, okay. Credit where credit is due. This is actually pretty nice. Pissing bench. <coughs> Good evening, my fair lady. You see those warriors from Hammerfell? They've got curved swords. Curved swords? Is that some sort of euphemism? I've met a few blokes with curved swords in my time. Any work around these parts? Here, take a look at this. 
Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. Yeah, I was thinking something more like washing dishes or serving meals. Any spare room for the night? Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Will the bard be here all night? It's just I didn't have the best experience over in Riverwood. You know what, never mind. Where can I learn more about magic? Magic is for the weak. Elves, I mean. They keep to that college in Winterhold. They know their place. Of course, there is Farangar. He might be the Jarl's wizard, but at least he's a Nord. Wow, so you're pretty offensive then. I can respect that, I guess. Any rumours? I assume you saw the Gildergreen? Big tree, all burnt up, in the middle of the Wind District? It's part of the Temple of Kinareth. People want Tanika to do something about it, but I don't know what they expect. Not yet, but I'll take a look this tomorrow. I'll show you to your room, right this way. Ah, what the fuck? Excuse me! Yeah, what the fuck are you playing at? Asshole! Ah, <sighs> not this fucking song again. Why? Could just snap his neck, get it over with. Too many witnesses. Better not. Ah, which way to the room, my lady? What can I do for you? Um, what's going on? Oh, you talk and you lie and you drink a lot of mead. Now I Ma'am, everything all right? You if you want so me to move this lady out the way, just say. This is awkward. Oh, Hello. guess that works too. Ragnar, Hooray! No this is your place. When you should really be firmer with idiots before. like that, me lady. I'd have kicked them out. Oh, wow. Let me know if there's anything else you need. Thank you. This is amazing. Look at that bed. Oh, my days. It looks so comfy. A billion times nicer than the one in Riverwood. That shield looks badass too. Imagine trying to wield that big boy. Hey, that asshole again. Can I help you? You're in my room, you dickhead. Hmm? Get out. Hmm? I said get out, you knobhead. Hmm? Fucking pissheads. Need something? No, get the fuck out my room. Better shut the doors. Can't be having pissheads coming in here while I'm trying to sleep. Don't even think about it. Walk away, bitch. You ain't coming in here. What the fuck is wrong with people, huh? No respect. Oh wow, this looks nice. Don't even think about it. Ugh. What is it with Whiterun and personal space? Finally time for some rest. This bed is amazing. What time should I set my alarm? Maybe seven hours time? That's good, right? Fuck it, eight hours. Ooh, level up! You leveled up. Choose an attribute to advance. Magicka, obviously. Hmm, what to choose? Should probably stick with Conjuration for now. Help Ghost out a bit more. Conjuration spells cost 35% less magicka. Last a little longer too. Sure. Oh, what's this? Choose which skills to increase. Skill points remaining 21. Looks like I can spend them in different areas. Hmm. What to choose? Should probably look to better my one-handed skills. That's what huh. she said. Oh, you. Yeah, very funny. I thought you had to conserve energy, and that was most definitely a waste of energy. I couldn't resist, sorry. You should speak to the old folk around town, see if any of them remember your father. One of them might remember something, maybe? Sounds like a decent place to try, the old folks. Guess that's where I'll start, then. Uh, sorry again. Speak soon. Cheeky bastard. Conserve energy, my arse. All done. That was the best night's sleep ever. This bed is amazing. I feel refreshed and raring to go. Can't believe that it costs the same for a night's stay in Riverwood. That takes the piss. Riverwood should pay you to stay there, the cheeky gits. The old man's spirit guardian is right. I should start looking for older folks around Whiterun, see if they can remember my father. Hopefully meet some kind old person to help me out. 
A little food, maybe a place to stay for a bit. Not too much to ask, I don't think. Failing that, at least I know there is plenty of work around here. Just need to earn enough to stay at the inn every night. Not cost effective, but workable. What is it with bards drumming so early in the morning? Is it part of the bard code or something? Be as obnoxious as you can. This is all pretty fancy, isn't it? Very posh looking. Oh, who's this then? Greetings, traveller. Greetings, my lady. Good luck out there. Oh, right. Okay, I guess. Thanks. Good luck to you too, ma'am. Not much of a talker, that one. Hmm. What's back here, then? Smaller than my room, but still very nice. I need a job so badly. Only 77 coin left. Shit! Better get my arse into gear and try and find something. Wonder if I could spit on the bard from up here. Can't really see him, unfortunately. Any useful books? Meh, not really. Should read them for the experience, though, I guess. The Holds of Skyrim. How exciting! Brief History of the Empire, Volume 1. Riveting! Greetings again, Mum. What the... Huh? What the fuck? Huh? Where'd she go? Looked like she'd eaten way too many blueberries. And now just vanished. Is she some kind of witch? Oh, that's her, isn't it? Down there. <clears throat> Seeing shit again. Oh, that looks delicious. Someone just left it there. Why? Don't worry, ma'am. I wasn't going to take it. I promise. Just wanted to nose through this private journal. Shh. Something strange happened today. I was hanging out at the Silver Blood Inn in Markoth when out of nowhere this strange orc was standing in front of me. Normally I have a fighting reflex when I see an orc. They make me stand on edge, hand on my weapon, ready for a brawl. I've learned to be careful with their kind from way too many violent encounters. But this orc was different. He was dressed up in fancy clothes, well-mannered and well-spoken. What struck me even more was this orc didn't smell of blood, sweat and two-day-old stale booze. He smelt pleasant. Spoke with fancy words. Gave me an invitation to an Altmer's mansion to discuss a job offer. Who says here that he'll pay a very, very large fee for the job. I'll read the rest later. Need to crack on with the day and this is a fucking novel. Can't believe they just left their journal lying there. Hope there's something juicy in it. There once was a hero named You Ragnar didn't see anything, all right? Nothing! And the did Bitch, better not snitch on me. As he told of old battles in gold he had made. But then he went quiet, did Ragnar the Red, when he met the Ugh, Altma. How vile. If you're looking for the court wizard, you'll find him somewhere in that general direction. Don't talk to me, lady. For the court wizard, not interested. If you wish to speak, not interested, damn you. you. Oh, I hate your face. Wine that requires my immediate attention. Damn it. Oh, I guess it's not your fault. Shouldn't lump everyone together like my mother. She could be pretty racist, God rest her soul. So, who are you? My name is Elderwyn. I've come to Whiterun for the Skyforge and for Farangar. So you're an alcoholic? I don't see that as a negative. My Nord friends often chide me for neglecting the rich history of Skyrim, as if I was ignorant of it. They say, you know, Elder, there's more to Skyrim Ugh, than just so old bored. Old spiced wine. And I tell them, yes, yes, I know all about your windmills and Ugh. bards and 12 different words for cold. I only care about the wine. Well, I gave it a good go. I just couldn't give a shit about you, lady. No offence. About time. Alt my bitch. Talk to me like that. <laughs> Cheeky. Seeing Altma folk just makes me think of the Thalmor, gets me worked up. Should get some fresh air, clear my head a bit. Move out the way, scum. 
Wonder if they'll let me borrow their cooker at some point. I'm no gourmet, but I dabble a little. Would save a few coins too. This place is a rip-off. Right, time to hunt down some old folks. Sounds a bit wrong when I say it out loud. Jeez, everything is covered in snow. Can't believe winter's here already. Sure is pretty, though. Fresh baked loaves. Still warm from the tired of bread and soup. Your Had enough of fish and fowl. Treat yourself and your kin to Hello again, my little goat friend. And a rack of ribs. Remain himself. Stupid dog. <laughs> Old person identified. Best go speak with her. Right See if she remembers father. Hi, me lady. Don't mind if I butt in, do you? Crafted by the best blacksmith in Good day, old lady. Bits and baubles for sale. All crafted by the best blacksmith in Skyrim. Oh, quite the statement. Who's the best, then? <laughs> I can tell you're new around here asking a question like that. My husband, Eorland, tends the Skyforge up at your Vasker. The Companion's Mead Hall. Oh, there's no finer smith in the Nine Halls. You should ask him about his work. It's the only subject that'll get him talking. Well, that and maybe those stuck-up, dung-sniffing battleborns. Dung-sniffers? Good burn, old lady. I like you. Now who's the battleborns? Don't even get me started on that lot. Huh, they put on airs like they're something special. Oh, sure, they've got money, but they ain't got a shred of honor between them. Grey Mane. Huh, now that's a name fills you with pride. We've got roots in white rum. We've got history. Roots? History? Ah, maybe you can help me. Look, old lady. My father is from white rum. I am trying to find someone that may have known him. Someone that can help me. His name was Thrunder Jorgensen. Ring any bells at all? Sorry, my dear. I don't recognize the name. Oh. But then my memory isn't as good as it used to be, unfortunately. Bugger! You really don't recognize the name at all? No, I'm sorry, dear. Well, that's just great. If someone as old as you doesn't remember father, what hope do I have? Is it worth asking around, do you think? People in Skyrim are pretty selfish. They will want help from you first, my dear. Make a bit of a name for yourself around here. I'm sure then they would help in return. Ah, okay. Help the locals. They help me. Seems fair, I guess. Thank you, old lady. You take care of yourself now. What a talented ventriloquist. Right, so the old lady the reckons I need to help the locals in order the for them to help me. Best have a walk around and see who may need some assistance. Can't believe she doesn't remember father. That is odd. She would definitely have been here when father was here. Strange. Guess she's just fucking old, losing her memory, bless her. Let's go and see if this lady needs a hand with anything. Could be useful being friends with a merchant. Trinkets for your good, lady. good day, milady. Life's hard enough with all these men propositioning me. But that bard is the worst. Ugh! Don't get me started on bards, milady. I can't fucking stand them either. That bard Mikhail is begging for a dagger up against his throat, the way he goes on about me. I heard him boasting at the bannered mare, saying he'll conquer me as a true Nord conquers any harsh beast. Huh. Wow, what an asshole! He really said that! What a wanker! Who does he think he is, huh? Want me to go tell him to back the fuck off? If you want to try, go right ahead. I don't think anything will get through that thick skull of his, though. I have my ways, ma'am. Just ask Sven over in Riverwood. So, you're the town hottie, then? You've got no idea. Half the men in Whiterun have proposed to me. Some were even single. They'll never understand. No amount of flowers or honeyed words are going to change my mind. Right now, all that matters is my daughter Mila. No man's going to get between me and my little girl. What about a woman? I mean, a MILF? Single mother? I totally respect that. You have to put your daughter above anything else. Bye, milady. Leave the bard Remember, to me. Fresh fruit and I'll take care of the dickhead. Mostly. Willow, ah. it's me. 
Oh, you. What's up? I'm sorry that old woman didn't remember your father, but she was right about something. Right about what? Try and help the townsfolk out with anything you can. Grow your reputation, and I'm sure they will repay you in kind. So, just help anyone and everyone? Regardless of what it is? I'll leave that judgment to you, for now. Maybe I could start by helping with that tree the landlady at the inn was talking about last night. The Gilda Green, I think it was. Good idea. Speak later, Willow. See ya. Hello, sir. And what might you need? Hmm? Listen, I ain't crazy, mister. I was talking to the spirit guardian in my head. All right. In prison. Phew, good save, Willow. I'm surprised you had the witch. Oi, oi, looks like these two are arguing. What with your nose Shh, better Willow. to fall off the emperor's backside? You won't be laughing when the Falmor come to root out Stormcloak's sympathizers. I've already put in a claim to the land and property you'll forfeit. When you're found to be a collaborator, I'll remember that when the Stormcloaks liberate the city. No amount of money will protect you then, Battle Stormcloaks liberating the city? Who the fuck are the Stormcloaks? Those Battle Mains and Greyborns really seem to hate each other. This must be the tree then. Doesn't look very special, does it? Are you alright, ma'am? It's a shame, isn't it? Oh, you're upset about the tree. Yeah, it does look a bit shit, doesn't it? The Gilder Green, yes. It's a bit of an eyesore at the moment. More of a problem for the pilgrims than for me. But not many of them around anymore. Sorry, what's special about it? To the east of here is a hidden grove where the Elder Gleam resides. It's the oldest living thing in Skyrim. Maybe all of Tamriel. Our tree here oh, in the city was grown off. from a cutting of that tree. You can still feel the glory of the mother tree through it. Even its name is an echo. Sorry, it was completely distracted. Anyway, to revive it. I've thought about that. Trees like this never really die. They only slumber. I think if we had some of the sap from the parent tree, we could wake up its child. But even if you could get to the Elder Gleam, you couldn't tap it. Not with any normal metal. Sounds complicated. Well, what sort of metal would work? Elder Gleam is older than metal, from a time before men or elves. To even affect it, you have to tap into the old magic. You'll have to deal with the Hagravens. I've heard about the weapon they've made for sacrificing Spriggans. It's called Nettlebane. The hags terrify me, or I would have gone after it myself. Hagravens? I don't know what a Hagraven is. Sounds like some sort of bird. Not sure what a Spriggan is either, but I'm here to help you, milady. I ain't scared of birds, ma'am. It would be my honour to retrieve Nettlebane from its nest. To restore the tree for Whiterun. Your spirit is strong. Kinareth's winds will guide your path. It's held in a Hagraven nest called Orphan Rock. See, a fucking nest? Who's scared of a bloody bird? Poor woman. This could really put my name out there in Whiterun, Willow, the Gilda Green saviour. Or, um, Willow, the bird butcher of Whiterun. Or perhaps Pilgrim's Choice, like the cheese. I'll work on it, all right. I wondered where all that shouting was coming from. Here we go, another nut job. Hello, my good man. Getting tired of hanging around talking all day. Show some respect. You're talking with the bird butcher of Whiterun. I'm going to save the tree. All right, then. All right, then. Ah, it's the Blueberry Witch. Yes. Hold, lady. I think you should go see the priestess. Something ain't right with you. Look, I'm not trying to be mean. I'm just trying to help folks, and your face is fucked. All right, then. Let's hope she gets the help she needs. How do I get over here, then? Ugh! Talos the unerring. Is he allowed to be just shouting out about Talos like that? My parents were fucking murdered for less. We are but maggots, writhing in the filth of our own corruption, while you have ascended from the dung of mortality and now walk among the stars. Good day, sir. You have come. You have come to hear the word of Talos. Look, dude, you should really be careful. 
Don't you know why Talos' worship was outlawed? Because the so-called Emperor is a coward. That's right, I said coward! Oh yes, he agreed to banish the worship of Talos at the tip of an Aldmeri sword. They called it the White Gold Concordat. Well, I call it blasphemy. A true son of the Empire would never have turned his back on our greatest hero. Not at any price. Well, let me tell you something, friend. Cyrodiil is a long way from here. And in Skyrim, we will never forsake mighty Talos. Ain't you worried at all. Both my parents were killed for Talos worship. Thalmor might come get you. <laughs> let them come. I have no fear. For Talos is my ally, and I am his prophet. His word is upon my lips. His voice in my throat. Hmm. Dunno why, but that sounded kind of sexual. Tell me some more about Almighty Talos. Hello, my friend. If you seek knowledge about Mighty Talos, you have most certainly come to the right person. In mortal life, Talos was a Nord, possessed of unmatched tactical skill, limitless wisdom, and the power to see into men's hearts. Talos mastered the power of the voice, and with it he united the lands of men into a great empire. In southern lands, he was known by the name Tiber Septim. Here in Skyrim, we honor him by his proper Nord name. So great was his reign in life. When he ascended to the heavens, he was made Lord of the Divines. If you want to know more, I'm sure you can find any number of tomes on the subject. Well, you have some big balls on you. I can tell you that, mate. Kinda loud, though, no? Is the shouting really necessary? I'm just asking! Take care, buddy. Can't believe Whiterun still has a shrine to Talos. I'm not complaining, but I thought it was outlawed here. Ugh, what's this? Follow the divine Talos. Already do, my brother. Improved attacks and shouts against elves. Amazing. End the war, eat a dragon's tongue, absorb a fucking dragon's soul. What's all this dragon bollocks, then? Dragons don't exist. What the hell? Been stitched right up here. Love! Did also say I should kill Thalmor, though, to honor Talos. Swings and roundabouts, I guess. Get the revenge I crave for the deaths of mother and father. All in Talos' name. Ugh! Sounds good to me. This guy must drive the locals insane. I thought the bards were bad enough. Wow, didn't see that before. It looks really impressive. I guess we someone important lives there. The is the true Need to get away from this mouthy git. Can feel a migraine coming on. To rule the realm. Ah, holy cow! A, uh, well, a cow. Ah! It is proper cute. Looks so stocky. Who's a little beefy boy? Tail looks a little strange though. I imagine that's what a mammoth's dick looks like. Oh, he's so small and chunky. Hey, little fella. Bet you're not cold. I want your fur, my dude. You look so cosy. Oh, imagine being wrapped up in that fur. So warm. See what's up here. Oh, muscle spasm. Oops. Huh, muscle spasm again. Should get that looked at. Hmm, what's going right on here then? No, please. I really don't have any money, Braith. I'll give you ten septums tomorrow. Just don't hit me. Ah, ten the classic town tomorrow, bully. That kid should really stand up for himself. What a little bitch! I'm a firm believer in karma. Don't worry, my boy. Oh, the bard. Oi, you! I'm a bard by trade. Perhaps you've heard of me. Back the fuck off the milf. She ain't interested. Carlotta put you up to this, didn't she? I'm sorry. 
But that fiery widow is mine. She just doesn't know it yet. Oh, I said back the fuck off. Bards are such assholes. What did you just say? All I heard was a sound of jealousy. Yeah, all right, mate. What's it gonna take to make you go away? 71 coin. Fuck you! Can't fight you. Need to maintain a good rep. I forget it. Already have. Don't think I won't be back for you, my friend. Arrogant prick. It's the leaving that's hardest, I know. You cocky son of a bitch! Fuck my rep! Oh, a god, you lucky little shit. If that guard hadn't been there, I'd have beaten the shit out of that little scrotum. Temple of Kinnereth. Too mad right now. Don't want to curse inside a temple. Uh, who's this then? Can't see any plaque. Holy shit! A Skyforged steel dagger. Just lying there like that. Should I? Mm, too many people. Come back after dark, maybe. Shit! Did you hear any of that? I will thank you not to interrupt me in my tasks. I was just messing about my good sir. None of my business, but saw you arguing with your missus earlier. Everything okay? My sapphire doesn't like that I've been spending so much time looking for my father's old sword. He fed his entire family with the gold he made using that weapon. I'm not about to let it gather dust in some thief's trophy room. Quite the pickle, my good man. I don't envy you. Emotional tug of war. I tracked it to a group of bandits nearby. But I'm no fool. I'd need the white run guards. Don't mind me, just passing through. Get it. I don't know why I'm saying this, but if you find it out in your travels, I'd be grateful to you. I'll certainly keep an eye out, my good sir. Mm hmm. Don't fancy visiting a bandit camp just yet, but we'll certainly return it to him if I ever find it. Looks like he may be able to train me in one handed. That's what she. Shut up! Oh. Using up all the pissing energy on that shit, really. I just can't stop myself. Sorry. Well, you better learn how to control it. Fucking wasting it all. Ooh, chickens! Oh yeah, that dude in Whiterun that works at the Sleeping Giant Inn wanted chicken eggs. If I help him, maybe he will like me. This isn't bad if it's helping someone else, is it? Stealing eggs, I mean. Nah, definitely okay. You saw nothing, chickens! Pretty big place, old White Run is. Wonder which house my father might have grown up in. Ah, oh, Blueberry Witch! Hold, lady. What are you still doing out here? I told you to get your fucked up face sorted out. Get help at the temple, old woman. Good day, sir. Miss. Oh. What's going on here? Look, you already have been told you're not allowed Shoelaces? Here. Turn around Again? and go back the way you came. We're causing no trouble. All we ask is to look for her. I don't care what you're doing. After what happened, you're lucky I don't toss you in jail. Now get lost. We will be back. This is not over. Sounds like serious stuff. You there. We're looking for someone in Whiterun. We will pay good money for information. Hmm. Good money, you say? Who are you looking for? A woman. A foreigner in these lands. Redguard, like us. She is likely not using her true name. We will pay for any information regarding her location. We are not welcome here in Whiterun. So we will be in Rorikstead if you learn anything. Understood. What did this person do exactly? They do something terrible? It's none of your concern. All you need to know is that we're paying for information. If that doesn't interest you, Feel free to walk away. Oh, I'm interested, my Redguard brother. Talos knows I could do with the coin. If you locate her, find us in Rorikstead. Will do. Take it steady now. They have to be talking about the waitress over at the inn, right? That woman was pretty shady, telling me to stop asking questions, plus she's a Redguard too. Should confront her when I go back to the inn later on. She gets fired, could be a job opening for me. Bit thirsty, need some water. Hi there, Mrs. Chicken. 
Get coin for snitching on her, then apply for her old job. Perfect. Oh no. What's happened to all the lovely cheese? They all look a little frosty now, covered in snow. My good lizard man, you should really cover up your delicious cheese. Yes. How much are they? Take a look. Had a feeling they would be a little out of my price range, unfortunately. Tight git won't even discount them, even though they're covered in snow. Goat's cheese is all I can afford, not a huge fan. I'll be back, my good lizard man. Mm -hmm. Right. Let's see what jobs are up on the notice board. Should stick with something simple for now. Delivery jobs. I could do that, I reckon. Willow the courier. Sort of has a ring to it. Deliver potion to Riverwood? Have to go back there at some point anyway. I am looking for a courier to deliver one of my potions to Orgnar of Riverwood. You will receive an upfront payment from me and payment on delivery. They need this tonic as soon as possible. Be sure to deliver it to them within the next few days. Arcadia. Payment up front, hell yeah! Deliver weapon to Riverwood. I'm looking for a courier to deliver a weapon to Feindel of Riverwood. Receive payment up front and upon delivery. Deliver it soon, deliver it on time. Ulfberth Warbear. More upfront payments, I like these jobs. Deliver letter to the Divide. Looking for a courier to deliver a letter to Town Dweller of the Divide. Payment up front and upon delivery, get it there on time. Anders. We'll pass on that one. The two Riverwood jobs should be enough for now. There he is, the goat of all goats. Thanks again for the axe, Mr. Goat. Should pop and see that Arcadia lady pick up the potion she wants delivered. Oh wow, look at how wasted that guy is. He's stumbling all over the place. Oh god, he's still on duty. Doesn't look like he's eaten the chicken just yet, though. That's a relief. Half expected to see feathers all around his mouth. Weirdo. This bloke is fucked. Look at him. You all right, sir? What do you want? You normally as fucked as this, my good man. Only if I can help it. But damn if I ain't almost sober. Hey, in the bannered mare, there's this bottle of Argonian ale. The good stuff. Get it for me. They won't even know it's gone. Come on. Mmm. I am supposed to help people, I guess. No problem, my pissed up friend. I shall retrieve it for you. Argonian ale. I can almost taste it. Isn't that the 500 coin bottle? Wouldn't mind trying some yes, of that yes. myself. Now, to find myself a drink. See ya, pisshead. Oh, hi again, Mum. Hopefully she didn't hear any of that. Right, let's pick up this potion. Got a pretty full stock of potions and alchemy reagents. Nice little shop she has here. So many different ingredients. For all ills, and I'll be happy to serve you. It's a nice shop you have here. Good day, ma'am. I have several elixirs for sale. You said you're a healer, can cure ailments, that's handy. You seen that blueberry witch at all? Of a sort. I don't have formal training in the restoration school, but something just as good. Within these walls, I have all that I need to brew a potion for nearly any ailment. If I had a septum for every case of rock joint or whitbane I've cured since I opened this shop, I'd be a rich woman indeed. So you ain't charging people? Dumbass. I'm here about the delivery job, ma'am. Of course. Fuck me, hundred coin up front. Jeez, you're awesome, lady. I will deliver it ASAP. Come back any time if you need a remedy. Will do, thanks, my lady. I offer remedies for a hundred coin? That's rare. fucking awesome. Do let me know if I can be of service. Wonder what she would do if I just didn't deliver it. Don't be a dick, Willow. She was nice. Nothing. And what of my son? Hmm? 
What of Thorold? Tired of bread Is he nothing? Had enough of fish so and don't fowl? Talk to me Treat about yourself stuff. and your kin to a choice cut. Your son chose his side and he chose poorly. Why is this guy bothering the old lady? Such is the way of war. The sooner you accept his loss, the better. I will never accept his death. My son still lives. I feel it in my heart. So tell me, Battleborn, the finest where country, is he? Fresh from the where are you holding my Thorold? Oh, Still they kidnapped her help? son? Shit! Poor old lady. Maybe I can help her. If I help her, maybe she will let me stay at her house, feed me, do granny things. Chops and steaks fit for a yarl. Come and see Oi, the you! Grey Mane or Battleborn? Huh? What you on about? Got stones in your ears? I asked what side you're on. Grey Mane or Battleborn? What the fuck you talking about, mate? New in town, huh? White Run's got two clans, both old and both respected. Difference is, the Grey Mains turned their backs on the Empire, and we Battleborn stayed loyal. So I'll ask again, Grey Main or Battleborn? I really don't give a fuck, buddy. Sooner or later, we all have to choose a side. Why are you bullying an old lady? Ain't right. More bad blood between the houses. Fralya is convinced our family is somehow at fault for the loss of their son. There's no reasoning with these people anymore. Leave her alone though, yeah. She's old as fuck. Come on, father. There's nothing more to be said here. Ah, must have a spirit guardian too, I guess. Talking to himself. Treat yourself and your kin to a choice cut of steak or a tender rack of ribs. Ripe fruit and fresh vegetables for sale. You are right, old lady. All I can think about is my son, my sword. They say that he was killed, but I know better. I know my son is alive. Those battle born, they're in with the Imperials. They know it too, and yet they lie to my very face. Sorry to hear about your son, but how do you know they're lying? It's not wise to discuss it here. Please, if you truly wish to help, meet me at my home. I'll tell you the whole story. Oh, sounds interesting. Meet at your home, you say? I'll pop by this evening. You would? Oh, that would be wonderful. Don't worry, old lady. I'll help you. I scratch your back, you scratch mine, right? See you in a bit. If I help the old lady, she might let me crash at hers for a few nights. Seems fair to me. She said her husband's the best blacksmith in Skyrim, too. Maybe he'll give me a few weapons for helping them out. Ah! Oh. Don't get greedy, Willow. A place to stay and some food would be suffice. Best pick up that weapon for Carol's boyfriend. Still need to earn some coin. Think the letter said to collect it from here. Wonder what the upfront payment will be. Things are starting to look up for me at last. War Maidens, cool name. Ah! Oh, a level up, nice. Let me know if you see anything you like. Can see one thing I like straight off the bat, my lady. Oh, don't be a creep, Willow. Sorry, Mom. Nice to meet you. Have you met my father? He's a steward up at Dragon's Reach. Can't say I have, ma'am, unfortunately. I'm new to Whiterun. Anything I hmm, should know? Plenty. I'd say we're prosperous enough. Most folk don't go hungry, if they're willing to work hard. The city's ruled by the Jarl up in Dragon's Reach. That's the fortress there, up on the tall hill. But you're probably more interested in your Vasker, Mead Hall of the Companions. Their deeds of war and valor are legendary. The Companions, hey? Yeah, I might have to go check them out, thanks. Sounds like Whiterun is doing all right for itself then. Glad people are getting by okay during these difficult times. Thanks for the info, appreciate it. Let me know if you see anything you like. Will do! Hey there, big man. Every Welcome to War Maidens. Now you, my girl, have definitely come to the right place. I do hope so. I'm here about the delivery job, my good man. Upfront payment? Of course. Ah, only 50 coin this time. Fucking cheapskate. <sighs> good enough, I guess. Who made the sword for Fred? Adrienne, at her forge, just outside. Place is named after her. War Maidens. It's a childhood nickname given by her father. What I hear, she was playing with swords even back then. Anyway, our wares are strong and the price is fair. What else matters? Nothing else matters, my kind sir. The name is badass. 
Good doing business with you. You too, big man. Deliver Fred's sword? Hang on, let's check this sword out, shall we? Ho, oh, the damage output isn't bad at all. Nice looking sword. Adrian did a good job with this. I'm sure Fred won't mind me using it for now until I can drop it off to him. I mean, he does owe me after all that business with Sven. Wants me to get it to him in one piece, right? He's lucky I don't just keep it myself as a reward, you know, for ratting out Sven. No, Willow, you need to help these people, not steal from them. Everything you see here was made with skill and care by my wife, Adrienne. Yeah, Adrian is pretty talented. You lucked out there, big man. Getting dark already. Not a bad day's work. Made 150 coin and I haven't even had to do anything for it yet. Up to 227 coin. Not too shabby. That should cover a few nights stay at the inn if the old lady doesn't work out. The lizard bloke still hasn't covered up the cheese, damn it. Would probably break my teeth trying to eat that now. Fool. Frozen solid cheese. What a waste. Evening, sir. Go fuck yourself, miss. Huh? Jeez. Rude. Hi there, good sir. Do you hunt? The plains outside Whiterun are ripe with game. Ain't got a fucking bow, mate. Otherwise, I'd love to. Want to give me yours, maybe? Good hunting. I'll take that as a no, then. Bye, sir. People just love to rub it in around here. Good hunting. Fuck you, mate. Can see I don't have a bow, arsehole. Told the old lady I'd meet at her house in the evening. Better check where she told me to go. Okay. Which house is hers, then? Greymane. That's her, right? Yeah, pretty sure she said she was something Greymane. Best get over there. It's evening now, isn't it? Willow. It's me. Oh, hi, old man. What you after? Just wanted to say well done for today. You have really put yourself around the town, looking to help the folk out. If you can follow through with these jobs, I'm sure people will begin to notice. Your reputation will start growing, people will respect you and want to help. I'm certainly trying. Off to meet the old lady now, hopefully I can help her out. Her son has been kidnapped. Keep doing what you're doing, Willow. I'm proud of you. Thank you. Appreciate the support. Don't forget about the crystals, though. I don't have much energy left now. Don't worry, I saw one as I was on the way into Whiterun. I'll make sure I grab it for us. Great. Speak to you soon. Yeah, speak later. Bye. Is this even the old lady's house? Why is it all locked up? Thought she said to meet her here this evening. Can't see another door on this side. I mean, what the actual fuck? Maybe I got the wrong house? Where's the old lady's quest? Hmm, can't see it. Oh, there it is! Oh, there's another door here. This is definitely the place then. Why the fuck is it locked then? Where is the old woman? Guess I'll just wait out here for a bit then. Hope she comes home soon. She must be getting pissed up with her husband or something, maybe. Ugh. She better be home soon. I'm freezing my tits off. I'll give it another hour then leave if she doesn't turn up. She's taking the fucking piss. <laughs>